Hello everyone and welcome back to Farming Simulator 2019. We are here on the Rice Riceyville, I don't even know how to say it, farming map. And we it is episode 3 of our farming series that we have uh, just begun. But we are working hard, alright, we are ready to, uh, we are ready to keep on making some money. So currently we have $179,000, which is a good amount of money to be honest with you. We're starting off very, uh, very fortunate, very well off. Um, we have all, we have fields four and three planted already and guys real quick um if you guys want to join my discord the link is down in the description my discord all of um some of my upcoming videos are teased there so make sure to go check it out um but yeah anyways let's get back in the uh into the video so we are currently here on around field three and four we uh, planted those already with soybeans um and we also have the sheep and the chickens ready. So we're doing we're doing pretty well off so far. But this episode, what we're gonna do is since the fields are still growing and stuff, we are going to help out some other farmers around us, and we are also going to take a look at um, some other. We're gonna try and take a look and see if we could do any odd jobs around the city. So basically, these these roadsides right here are, need to be mowed, and the city wants us to take care of it. So we are whoa, we are going to take care of it. So. Basically, first off, let us let us see what the options are for contracts. So basically, let's open up the contracts menu. And there are multiple different options here. We could do many different things. But I think we're going to start off at field 15. And we need to cultivate that field. So what we're going to do is we're going to accept that contract. We are going to need to borrow the items for that one. At least, say, at least machines are waiting for you at the shop. Remember to fill the tools if needed. So perfect. So we are going to head down to the shop so i will um we're gonna actually i'm gonna take you guys along with the trip down to the shop so basically yes what we're gonna try and do on this map is we're gonna try and make as much money as possible um we really want to do the best we can for our farm and really just try and progress as much as we can make a lot of money uh we do currently have sheep and we also have um chickens so we are making wool and uh, eggs so that is that's very good indeed Whoa, okay, I spun out a little bit. I need to be a little more careful with the driving. I didn't even notice I was going so fast. Anyways, let's turn into this here. Anyways, yeah, so in the job the town wants us to do some roadside jobs, help them out. Um they just they're calling for other people with their own mowers to help out with them. So we'll probably make a decent a substantial amount of money for that. So that'll be very good indeed. But perfect. We are on our way to the shop right now to help out uh, one of our fellow farmers, and they're gonna actually he's gonna actually be paying us. Which is, uh, which is definitely good for us. So, perfect. Let's pull into here. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And he just, um, gave us some, uh, items to help us out here. So, perfect. Uh, let us, we're gonna pull in right here and we're just gonna back up our truck. Wow, this thing is beauty. Let me tell you, it is nice. I like it a lot. Perfect. Let's back it up here, right in the spot. Oh, man. That was a little bit rough, but it's okay. Nah, we're good. We got her. Alright, let's turn her off and we're gonna put in tow mirrors, too. Oh man, this thing's a beauty. You know, if uh, you gotta look back at your truck, you know it's you know it's beautiful. Oh, don't do it, don't do it. Oh man, there it is. Perfect. Let's grab. Let's get into our tractor here, and we are going to go to. Need to go to what field is it again? I believe it is field fifteen. Okay, field fifteen. So that is a. That is a decent... I can't even find it. Oh, okay. I see where it is. So, guys, what we're going to do is I'm going to just start a tr um, uh, time lapse right now. We're going to drive down to the farm, and we are also going to just start cultivating it right away. So, guys, I will see you when we get down uh, after... No, after we cultivate... Um, after we cultivate the field. <laughs>
Okay, guys, so we just finished up the, um, this job here, and that took me, let me tell you how long that took me. That took me about an hour and 15 minutes to complete, so, uh, that did take a, a decent amount of time, let me tell you. But, um, now it is time for us to go back down to our own farm, and, um, well, actually, no, first we have to go down to the shop, and we have to... Uh, we gotta, what do we gotta do? What do we gotta do? We gotta collect our money, and we also have to give this tractor back to the, uh, store as well. And then, what we're gonna do is we're probably gonna do our best and maybe do some odd jobs around the off, um, not around the office, oh my goodness, I was, <laughs> maybe do some odd jobs around the farm, stuff like that, so that would definitely be good. Um, but yes, that did take me a, uh, very, very... Decent amount of time in real life. That time lapse is probably going to be pretty, uh, pretty fast paced, but, uh, you know, that's cool, you know what I'm saying? So perfect. Oh, look at this. This is a nice little lake down here, not going to lie. I kind of like it. Kind of cool, kind of cool. Looks like you can get water from there, too. So that must be good for other farm owners here. But what I want to also do is I'm thinking about, um, starting just do a couple factories on this map as well. So maybe do not, not many, obviously, just a couple for now. Um, Maybe I'd, in, I'd be interested in putting it in the land next to, uh, right over here in front of us, actually, coming up. Because this is, we actually own this, too, here as well. So that would definitely be, um, right up here. So that would definitely be interesting as well, because there's a good amount of space. We could do some, maybe honey or stuff like that. But, yeah, we definitely have to look into that po as a possibility. Maybe help us make some more money, give us some stuff to do when, uh, when there's, uh, not much to do around the farm. Anyways... Uh, as we are back on our way down to the farm, guys, how is everyone's day? Let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, my day is going, it's, it's going pretty well. It's, um, Saturday right now. Uh, today was a decent day. Um, but yeah, perfect. We are we're just chilling on our way down to the farm. Now, I do have three, um, a couple more plans for this episode, so I believe what I'm going to do is I kind of want to purchase a, um, a little gator, but, you know, I'm not sure yet. So I'm definitely going to look into that as a possibility. Maybe we'll check the catalog, look in that, see if there's, see if we should um, get that or not. But perfect, perfect, perfect. So probably going to do some roadside mowing, maybe, um, maybe organize the farm, stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, that would be definitely very good here. But let's take our left turn right over here to um, the road down to the bridge. And we're right, we're pretty close to the... Pretty close to the farm indeed, so let's turn it. There we go, perfect, and we are going up. Man, this is a, this is a very nice map, by the way, guys. All the links to the mods uh, below are... All the links to the mods are down in the description as well, if you guys are interested in playing um, with your own version of this map. Perfect, 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 perfect. So, yes, yeah, so perfect. And let us take... We're going to be taking a right turn right here into the John Deere dealership. Well, there's one side that's the John Deere, and then there's one more where there's just kind of an actual store. So, John Deere's, you know, usually bought in there, stuff like that. But, you know, this isn't a John Deere. As you can tell, it's a Fent. And I'm not exactly sure what type of cultivator it is, but... All right, perfect. Let's just park this over here by the uh, section. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now, let us collect our goal. So, we got $6,000 from that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We just uh, collected that. And that is that's a good good amount of money. $193,000. $6,000 was... Uh, not sure if it was worth it or not. Not going to lie. But, no, I'm playing. It, it was a good amount. Let's roll up these windows since it is raining here. Guys, I would also be interested in doing a... A, um... First person only... Whoa, I just slid out. That was probably because of the rain. Sorry about that, guys. But anyways, I would be interested in doing a uh, first-person-only farming video. That would be kind of cool. Kind of be interesting. See if, I, uh, see if we could handle it down here. Um, but that would definitely be kind of interesting to try and take on as well. It would kind of be an interesting challenge, you know what I'm saying? It would be very realistic. Um, definitely very, very realistic. So that would be good. Perfect. Let's slow down here. We don't want to crash or anything. Yeah, see, this thing, this thing kind of just drifts, you know what I'm saying? Like, it kind of just, around turns and stuff, you can, she kind of just goes, you know what I'm saying? Like, let me take a turn. I'm not sure if it'll do it, because it's, we're going only, like, 10 miles an hour here, but. Yeah, it doesn't do it on, like, so you gotta be slow around the corner. Alright, I have to be a good good driver. Normano has to be a good driver, so that's gonna be, uh, it's always been hard for Normano, if you guys, uh, didn't know. Perfect. See, I love how this, you can raise the hitch and lower the hitch on this truck. It is very useful. Very versatile. 
Perfect, so let's just pass this guy here and pull up to our farm. Oh, man, like I said, we just, uh, we did it again, we did it again. Alright, perfect, so right now all of our vehicles are in the rain and stuff, so I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna, maybe we should park them and organize them real quick. And we'll see if there is anything else that we could potentially do. Alright, anyways, let's get into this bad boy. I like the JCB. It's uh, very, very useful. It goes very fast, too, so that's that's always good. Anyways, let's bring it around here, and we're just going to put it in this area of the farm right over here. I'd also like to get a um, more equipment sheds here so that we can, you know, if, eventually if we ever need it, uh, we could get, um, put all of our sheds in, I mean, put pull our sheds in the sheds. No, put, our, pull our, put all of our vehicles in the sheds if we need to. Um, but yeah, perfect. It's like here we have we also have one two we have oh three more bays three and a half kind of so let's grab this guy here and I love how this farm is right on the river bank it is kind of definitely kind of cool we get to see the uh, this bad boy coming around sometimes so yeah that's very interesting but perfect 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 let's bring this cultivator or no this is a this isn't even a cultivator my bad this is a uh, how, what do you call it again, guys? Oh my goodness! Not a cultivator. It's not a. Uh, it's not a. It's a what call it? I can't believe I'm forgetting. I'm blanking on the name completely. All right, that was not very straight. Let's try it again. That's a little bit better, I guess. So it is kind of going out, but it's still covered by the um, by the shed. So that's good here. And let's just park. We're going to keep all the vehicles on one side and all of the equipment and stuff on the other side. I think that'll be, uh, I think that'd make it a little more appealing. Perfect. So let's bring this around. And we're just going to put this right here. There we go. Let's park her in. And perfect, perfect, perfect. So now it is time for us to put the GCB in here. We'll see. We're probably not going to get the, uh, the John Deere in there. Actually, I'm sure we could probably, we could probably, I'm sure we could fit it. Alright, perfect. So, currently it has the, um, the cord header on. I believe this is, and then we have the regular, good old. So, let's just bring this. Looks like we're just going to have to spin this around real quick. One of them does actually have to stay on. So what we'll do here is we will detach this. We're going to detach... No, nope, we're going to detach the trailer. Yeah, perfect. Detach the trailer, and we're going to pull this bad boy around. Take that off, and we're just going to put that one on the trailer rather than the corn one, because we're probably going to be using... Not the corn, my bad. Uh, we're going to keep this 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 uh, versatile header. And we're probably going to use it much more than the corn one. We will eventually have to trade these out for bigger ones since we do have fairly large fields. We don't have that big fields yet compared to the field we just harvested and stuff like that. But, oh. There we go, guys. Driving is tough for Normano, as you guys know. Perfect. Let's pull this. Get this bad boy. Perfect. Let's just pull it up here. Perfect. That looks like that is exactly what we want here. For some reason, uh, I just put the... There we go. That's better. And now what we're going to do is we want to put the header on the machine. And we're just going to pull... We're going to pull the... Uh, the corn off to the side, or the corn attachment on the trailer off to the side. I actually know where we can put this. We can put this inside of this little machine shed over here. It's going to be kind of hard to back up. It might be a little bit of a pain, but I think that'll do. Oh, yep, like I said, a little bit of a pain. Perfect, and we're going to cut it now.
perfect, perfect, perfect. That is in there. Not very straight, but uh, that's okay. It's protected from the inclement, the inclement weather. We're gonna lower this attachment here. Oh, we don't want to keep that pipe out. Oh man, looks like it might not fit in here. So that might be a little bit of an interesting. Uh... Nope, doesn't fit. Oh my goodness, what are we doing? Oh man, like I said, Normano has trouble. Wow, we got it in sideways, so that's good. How are we going to get this out? That's the real question. Alright, perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright, perfect. We're going we're gonna to clean this up. Let me just spin this like this. Oh, we got her, we got her. Slowly but surely, we're moving her. And this will just allow us to spin around. Perfect. Now that we got that, what we're going to do is we're just going to put it... Oh my goodness. You guys didn't see that. We're just going to put it right over here. This seems a little... Oh, yeah. Perfect. And now it's underneath this, so it'll be out of any inclement weather. For the most part. Um, can't be perfect, but... I'm going to back her up, and we're just going to put her right in. There we go, there we go, there we go. We're going to turn the JCB off. And we're going to go see if the ca uh, the sheep, my bad. Let's see if the sheep need anything in the menu here. Animals menu. Looks like they are good. Grass and hay, they're pretty much full. Perfect, perfect, perfect. There we go. They're good in water and everything. They look pretty uh, healthy over here, not going to lie. Perfect. We did a good job with them. Guys, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Hope you guys all did enjoy uh, thank you all for watching, have a good one, and take it easy.